Hi everyone and welcome back to another episode of Science. Today I want to show you a decomposition reaction where I'm going to be heating up copper carbonate over a Bunsen burner flame. My word equation and reactants are copper carbonate. Now with the introduction of heat that is going to break apart the copper carbonate, it's going to decompose it in order for me to produce copper oxide and carbon dioxide. These are my two products. The chemical equation here, I've got copper carbonate, chemical reaction occurring, copper oxide plus carbon dioxide, CO2. I'll put that to the side for just a moment and then I'll get set up with my Bunsen burner flame here. Just the camera. Okay, so I'll be using um, copper carbonate and it's this very fine green powder looks pretty cool and I've got it sitting in this test tube here I'm just going to be placing that over the Bunsen burner flame I'll get my wooden tongs change it to a blue flame Probably can't even see that on the camera. And it's just going to take a few seconds to warm up. Let's see if I can adjust the camera. You can probably start to see it going black now. I might just leave it there so that you can see the contrasting colors so that green stuff that you see there is still the copper carbonate and the black stuff that you see is the copper oxide the carbon dioxide gas has already escaped at the other end of the test tube pretty cool hey I can put it back into the flame to finish the reaction and readjust the camera and slowly but surely that copper carbonate is decomposing into copper oxide and carbon dioxide all right and i think that's just about Done. Let me turn off the Bunsen burner just so it's safer for me to move around. Zoom back out. So there we have copper oxide. Pretty cool. Smash the like button, hit subscribe, share with your friends, and I'll see you on the next episode of Science.